New advertising technology is raising questions about your privacy. A company working with Uber and Lyft drivers is offering them money to put interactive tablets in their cars for targeted ads. But two U.S. senators are saying hold on, and they want some answers. Tim Blotz is here, and Tim, we're talking about new uses for artificial intelligence. Yeah, specifically face recognition technology that can identify your race, your gender, approximate age, and then use that data to target you with advertising and what the marketing world calls content. But Senator Amy Klobuchar wants to know whether that violates your privacy. Artificial intelligence is everywhere and now coming to the back seats in rideshare cars. An audience engagement company called Alfi is working with Uber and Lyft drivers to install tablets in their cars. Alfi's website says it uses artificial intelligence and computer vision to better serve ads to people. Its algorithm understands small facial cues and perceptual details that make potential customers a good candidate for a particular product. Now this has all kinds of big problems. U.S. Senator Amy Klobuchar wants to know who's collecting the data and where it's going. And I think your own data and privacy should be your own. You have a reasonable expectation of privacy when you get into the back seat uh, of a rideshare. Uh, secondly, um, who knows what else they're recording? Are they listening when you talk? Both Klobuchar and Delaware Senator Richard Blumenthal sent a letter this week to the CEOs of Uber and Lyft. They're demanding to know whether they have a business relationship with the company providing the digital tablets or the advertisements. Also, how do their privacy policies apply to the tablets and ads? And how is this essentially different, Senator, from the targeted ads that you and I get on our Instagram pages or Facebook pages. It's actually very similar. I think the worst part about it is many of those targeted ads are just based on what you search for. This is actually going to be recording your face and entering it into some kind of a, a, a database and knowing where you are, what you're doing, where you're going, maybe even who you're talking to. Alfi did not answer a request for an interview, but its website says their automation respects user privacy without tracking, storing cookies, or using identifiable personal information. But it's all data that Senator Klobuchar believes people should be able to control for themselves. So if your data is going to be used and sold to the highest bidder for an ad, you should make money off it, not them. Um, and you should be able to turn it off at any moment. And Senator Klobuchar says she's not condemning this particular project, product, rather, just how it's being used when it comes to people's privacy. Kelsey?